Hello, you're listening to Hugo Talks. Businesses in Italy have defied the lockdown rules. It says here, 30,000 Italian businesses, predominantly restaurants, have defied government lockdown rules by all opening at once in a protest against the rules. It says here in Italian newspaper, 30,000 civil disobedience triumph. Launched on social networks with the hashtag IOA Pro 1501, which translates to I open on January the 15th. The initiative has collected tens of thousands of followers. As can be seen in these clips, it's not only restaurants, but also some gyms and other businesses who joined in. The mainstream media around the world have not reported on this whatsoever. There seems to be a complete blackout on this news. Italian police in Rome have been fining restaurants and those who have attended, but due to the widespread nature of the protests across the country, it looks like it has been impossible to police. Going by some of the videos posted on social media, many of the rest Restaurants stayed open throughout the night and played music. Although I can't verify this, but it does state on some posts that the restaurants did not serve food, they merely opened and allowed people in as an act of protest. Restaurateurs have appeared on national television in interviews berating the laws and also opposing politicians have also posted messages on social media supporting the protest. People were called with the hashtag to go to their favorite restaurant to support them. One video shows how the northern Italian city of Piacenza, the police were booed on entering the premises by the guests in the restaurant. The video then shows the police leaving. The hotel and catering industry is struggling in Italy. Restaurant owners say they're being destroyed by the regulations. They're complaining that they are going down financially. As I've already stated, this is not something that is being covered by mainstream media, so please go out and share this video. As always, thanks for listening. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and go to hugotalks.com and subscribe so we can keep in touch in case YouTube censor this channel in the future.